Good evening friends and fans. I have here a 1971 Nissan Skyline GTR from M2. Obviously only available from Walmart. Uh, I bought this because I'm not really a car fan, but I like Nissan Skylines. Uh, I have actually quite a few Hot Wheels and I figured, you know what, what's the worst that could happen? It is a little bit more, but I mean, hopefully it's going to be a little bit better. Right away, you see it has the plastic case on it as well as the cardboard. The cardboard is nothing fancy actually. They're, they have the other line that actually I think looks better than this. But this one, from what I can see, special M2 features, stuff like that, die cast body, Japanese writing. I don't really read Japanese, but it probably says auto art, but I'm not sure somebody in the comments below can tell me. And so here we have it. Up. A little bit complicated as you can see, but lo and behold, here we have it. Yellow, I mean, not crazy about yellow, but better than I think. Pl no, plain white's good too. And the good thing about this is you can see the plastic case covers the entire thing. Uh, it has a little M2 thing on the top there. Mine happens to be centered. I saw quite a few that were not, but that's uh, everybody their own. So the car looks really nice. It has obviously the rear view mirrors on the front of the hood there. And very good detail too. Look at the writing. The Nissan right on the front there. And Skyline. The wheels are very plain. I'll give it that. And it says GTR on the back there. Very good detail overall, I'd say. And as all Skylines, I think it's right. Yeah, it's way hand drive. I'm a little bit disappointed though the doors don't appear to open. Usually these ones in the bo plastic boxes I've seen they have opening doors but I guess you can't. Oh! There's the hood. And the engine detail. Plastic parts. No it's all metal. And you can see the connector they used for the rear view mirrors. So overall, I mean, it's not a bad model. Uh, another thing too is you can actually disconnect it from the base, should you wish to. Take a look at the detail underneath. There we go, it says 1971 Nissan Skyline GTR used under license. And on the top, 2017 cast line. I guess that's the, mo the number of them they've made. And this one is 15,017 out of 15,270. And made in China. This is the standard these days. As you can see, it's a two piece body. And M2 on the front there, with another screw, I think this come out and you can actually change the wheels. I'm not going to do it on this one because I know you guys don't have 15 minutes to watch me attempt to use a screwdriver properly. But here we are, Nissan Skyline. Overall, I'd say a really good buy. I mean, it's a little bit more than your, your average Hot Wheels and green light, but I think it's worth it. You buy what you like and like what you buy. Alright guys, thanks for watching. This is... Thomas from Toronto and have a great evening.